Thank you for subscribing to the channel. And for those of you that haven't subscribed yet, it would be much appreciated. Thank you. Now what I want to talk to you about today is the difference between long form and short form. Now the first thing people think of when they hear short form, they think of just a few words or a children's story or just a short story in general. And yeah, that, that's kind of true in part. Uh, and when they hear of long form, they think of a book of 50, 100, 300,000 words. Um, or a video that's three hours long, as opposed to a short form video that might be uh, 20 minutes long. So it's not quite that simple. For example, um, we could be talking about the same story. And let's say, for instance, this is um, The Martian. Uh, you'll all be familiar with that, no doubt. Now, this is, or it could be, the long-form version of The Martian. And it's quite a chunky book. But is it the long-form version? Well, it's hard to say. Uh, I don't know whether uh, Andy Weir had actually produced the book at a thousand words to start with and that was the long form version and he's put it into a short form version or a shorter form version of 400 words um, he's got rid of a lot of the stuff from it that a lot of us might have enjoyed reading but it could have just been too much it could have been too big whether that's the case or not I don't know or whether it was a short form version, something like this when he started, about this thickness. And he's drawn this whole thing out into a long form version with stuff in there that we don't really need to know. Whereas the whole thing could have easily fit in a short form version. And we'd have had all the, all the facts, everything we knew, all in that short form version. I'll give you another example. You know, we've often sat and watched a, a movie and it's been like two and a half hours long and you've sort of pushed yourself through it. Yeah, it's been interesting, you know, but um, it, it's been a slow burn, you know, or it's it's just, it's been, it felt drawn out. And you, you just, at the end of it, you may have said, well, God, you could have got that into an hour and a half. And that hour and a half would have been the short form version of that long form video and it would have had everything in it that you needed all the important facts and uh, to get you through from uh, start to finish but then there's other people that would have liked the long form version now a lot of people will say a short form version of um, some wording could be around a thousand words or less um, and others might say anything over 1500 words is a long form but it doesn't it like i say it doesn't really work like that it's not necessarily on all about the number of words that you put down it's just a shorter version of a story or non-fiction um book or uh, blog post um, social media post article than what it could have been and just because it's an article doesn't mean it's a short form um, article it still could be a long form article and a more condensed concise version of that long form um, article will be the short form version now a lot of people like long form novels we're giving you loads of detail multiple characters dozens hundreds of characters even um, but lots of detail about each of the characters, what's going on in the story, what the weather's like, what um, colour the leaves are on the trees. All this can contribute to the long-form um, book. But basically, it really depends on your audience. If you want to get your point across in as few words as possible, that would be considered a short-form book, especially if you could have made it three or four times longer. And you didn't need to you've just got your point across and or you've got your story from start to finish it's been exciting um maybe leaving people with um 
wondering what about this and who was that and why were that and you know and a few questions uh, which in a long form book you'd have filled out no doubt so you can basically have a long form and short form version of the same book and you know that's that's the way to look at it really long form pack in as much detail as you want um, to tell your story short form get your point across in as few words as you need to without losing too much from your story and yeah i hope that helps